We are live once again. What's going on, everyone? This your boy, Zach Shaw. He mentor with Zach.net. And it is time for another live Zach fact. It is about to go down on a Saturday. All right, it's time for some Saturday value. So as you guys are popping in, as always, leave me a comment below. Let me know where you guys are living in from. And also make sure you click down the button below and share this out so we can give more people some value, okay? And matter of fact, let me go ahead. Facebook says still is building this audience up. So let me make sure I invite all of my people who asked me to remind them about this live mm -hmm. Zach fact. I see you guys popping in now. So again, as you guys are popping in, leave me a comment. Let me know where you guys are living in from. Where are you watching this broadcast live from? Um, you know, of course, I am broadcasting live from the great city, the beautiful city of Shahidville, Columbus, Georgia. So I'm um, about to give you guys some value. Just making sure I share this out real quick to all of my peeps, all of my awesome peeps. So uh, if you're watching this on the replay, you can uh, skip past this part as I'm welcoming in all of my live viewers. But I want to make sure... I give all of my peeps a chance to ask me to remind them to pop in. What's up, Matt? Matt is in the building. What's going on, man? What the DMV looking like? And I know, Matt, I know. I got to get to the DMV pretty pretty soon. I already know. <laughs> all right. So, yeah, guys, look. It is time for this live Zach fact. We are going to talk about how to use Facebook Live properly to build your business, to generate leads and create sales for your business. For, so, first of all, for those of you who do not know me, okay, if this is your first time on one of my live Zach Facts, my name is Zach Shaheed. I'm broadcasting live from Columbus, GA. And guess what, guys? I am here to help you guys learn how to brand yourselves online and learn how to generate leads for your business so you can ultimately convert those leads into sales. So if you're somebody that has an online business, whether it's uh, affiliate marketing, network marketing, or you may even have a traditional business that you're trying to learn how to use the power of the internet to build your business. That is what I, I am here to help you guys with, okay? So if you want to learn how to generate leads, if you want to learn branding, I'm that guy. I'm here to help you out. I'm here to give you guys tons of value today. What's going on, Jason? Welcome, welcome to the broadcast. So today's Live Zach Fat guys are dedicated to all of my business owners out there who are using Facebook Live you know, to get some buzz about their business. Now, you guys probably, if you've been following me for a long time, you guys probably already know, I like, I highly encourage mm -hmm. everybody to do videos, right? Highly encourage you to do videos because mm -hmm. when you do videos, it helps build your brand faster, especially on social media. But what I've been finding out, finding out guys, mm -hmm. is that some people need some help. Some people need some help around the proper way to do a Facebook Live, okay? I see a lot of you guys out there are using Facebook Live. Um, some of you may even be using like other social networks like Periscope. So you're doing your live videos, guys, but I wanna make sure you are properly doing this the right way when you're doing your videos, okay? Because some of you just need a little bit more tweaking when you're doing a video so you can get the maximum impact, okay? I want you guys to get as the best results you can get, so I am here to share that with you today. So the very first thing, guys, I want to tell you, what's up, Bernita? Bernita's in the building. So the very first thing I want to share with you all on how to properly do a, use a Facebook Live to generate leads and build your brand online is, guys, listen, whenever you do a Facebook Live video, whenever you go live, okay, First of all, make sure you give a proper introduction. Okay, right? Like, write this stuff down, guys. It's gonna sound simple, but some some people are missing this in their live streams and they're wondering why they're not getting the results they want. So the first thing you have to do is give a proper introduction. Okay. So when you come live, guys, you have to tell your viewers what they can look forward to. Okay, just like when I came live, I told you guys I am here to help you generate leads online. I'm here to help you brand yourself online. I am here to help you learn how to use Facebook Live to properly do all those things, right? I gave you a proper introduction. Some of you are jumping on your videos and we have no clue, <laughs> like, why are you here? And like, it takes too long for us to figure out why you are here. It should not, guys, you got to remember, your audience attention span sometimes is like that. Okay, so if you don't give them a proper introduction on why they need to be on your live feed, then they're going to be dropping off. 
Okay, give them a proper introduction. What's going on, Carleon? So that's the first thing you guys have to do when you are coming live and you're about to do your broadcast. Always, always give a proper introduction about what you are going to talk about, okay? Number two, guys, when you come live, okay? This is what you always wanna do. When you come live, you wanna always give, okay? Give, give, give. You guys know value is my favorite word. I'm always talking about giving value, right? You guys have to give more, give more than you ask for. See, some of you guys are coming on here and all you're doing is asking people to buy from you. All you're doing is asking people to join your team, but you have not given them anything, okay? And you guys, I've said this plenty of times, but I gotta let you guys make sure this soaks in, okay? Carleon said he's soaking up the knowledge. I appreciate it, Carleon. Make sure you share this out, man, so we give some value to some other people. So listen, guys, you got to give. You got to give before you ask, okay? Some of y'all are asking, 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 but you have not given anything to your audience, okay? So what can you give, okay? Y'all guys always hit me up to talk about value, but what else can you give, okay? So if you guys think about last week, that's one of the reasons I've been giving away the free vacations, okay? I'm giving my audience something, mm -hmm. okay? I'm giving them something. What's up, what's up, Tawana? How's, how's it going, how's it going? Welcome to the broadcast. Welcome, welcome. So, um, yeah, guys, you have to give, okay? Some of you are coming on these broadcasts and you are asking. You're asking for to join your team, buy your products, you know, all this stuff, but you have not given your audience anything, okay? You guys have to give more. The more you give, Okay, the more you will get. Do not be afraid to give away free stuff. Okay, do not be afraid to give away free value. What's up, Nakia? That's why I come on here and do these Zach facts because I want to give you guys, you know, the stuff that's going to help you build your business. And guys, the more you give, the more you give, I'm telling you people will be more receptive to listening to you and then people will want to buy your stuff. Okay, because they know you come live all the time and you are giving. Okay, you're not just asking them for stuff. So remember that, guys. Give, 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 give. You should be giving value. You should be giving away free gifts. Whatever it is, give away. <laughs> okay, give stuff away. The more you give away, the faster you're going to generate leads because people love free stuff. So think about your business, okay? I <laughs> see amen and preach. I appreciate it, guys. Look, so listen, think about your business. Think about your product or service and ask yourself, what can you give away? Okay, what can you give away? It don't have to be nothing really major, guys. Okay, it can be like a free ebook. It can be a sample to your products. Okay, all this stuff, you got, remember, you're a business owner. It's a tax write-off anyway, right? So ask yourself, what can you give away? And when you come live, give that stuff away. Okay, like I love giving away free training. Okay, matter of fact, after this video, I'm going to post a free training about Facebook Live, so you guys can get more training around Facebook Live. So ask yourself, what can you give away? Think about your business, think about your brand, your product and service, and ask yourself, what can you give away on a regular basis when you come live to your audience, okay? The next thing is, guys, you have to be consistent, okay? You have to be consistent. You get, I, I've said it before, but I'm gonna let y'all soak this up again. Your audience cannot see you here one day and then you take a break for a month and then nobody knows where the heck you went. And then all of a sudden you want to come back and, and you think your audience is going to be this huge audience. It's not going to happen. Guys, you have to stay consistent. What's up, Arvella? Arvella's in the building. So you guys have to stay consistent. So when you're giving value, you're giving your giveaways, you got to stay consistent, guys. Your audience needs to see you show up. You got to show up regularly. Okay? Not just every so often. Regularly. Okay, I tell you guys this all the time. Look at your favorite mentor and ask yourself, how often does your favorite mentor shows up? And if, you're, if, you are not, if you are not showing up more or as much as your favorite mentor, you're not doing enough. You are not doing enough. All the six and seven figure earners, they show up. So you guys have to show up. Let me see, Jason says, I followed you for so long and this is why. Hey, I appreciate it, Jason. I appreciate it, man. You know, make sure you share it out, bro. Let's get some other people some value. So, um, yeah, guys, you got to stay consistent. You got to stay consistent. Next thing, when you guys are doing your Facebook Lives, stay positive. Stay positive. 
Let me, guys, write this down because some of you have totally missed it. Stay positive. I can't tell you how many Facebook lives I have seen where people are venting and being negative, you know, on their Facebook lives. What type of audience do you expect to build when you are not positive? Okay, you have to stay positive. What up, James? What's going on? Welcome, welcome to the broadcast. Stay positive, okay? And let me give you an example of this, right? I know people, especially that are in affiliate marketing, network marketing, you guys come on Facebook Live and you start bashing jobs, okay? You start saying jobs suck, screw your job, leave your job, you know, all this type stuff about jobs, right? That's being negative, guys. What's up, Ryan? My boy Ryan's in the building. You cannot come on your Facebook Live talking about you are a freedom fighter, you're trying to help some people get free, and you are knocking the job. Guys, first of all, what you have to remember is most of your audience, you, your audience you're speaking to, they have jobs. They have jobs, right? So if you come on your Facebook Live and you are bashing jobs, okay, you got to think, in, guys, think about your prospect, okay? Before you post stuff, start thinking about how your prospect will take that in. First of all, what you have to realize is most of your prospects already have limiting beliefs on their life. Okay, they already have preconceived limiting beliefs that they cannot build a business, that the only thing they can do is work a job. So when you come online on your Facebook lives and you are bashing jobs, trying to get people to sign up for your business, guys, you are being negative. Your audience is going to look at you as a negative person. They are not going to join you. I know in your mind it may sound good. You know, but guys, you cannot do that. What you need to do is offer them a solution. OK, offer them a solution, a backup to their job. OK, so teach them, teach them the importance of having residual income, teach them the importance of having extra money in the bank. OK, but you don't want to bash a job because guess what? Most people that watch your live streams, they are using their job to build their business. Most people in network marketing are still working a job. They are using their job to build their business. So if you are coming on a Facebook Live and you're bashing jobs, you are putting a negative image in your prospect's head about you. What's up, James? James in the building. Leon's in the building. Hey, I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Emery, what's up, Emery? Emery's in the building. So stop being negative, guys. Stop being negative. Stop coming on here talking about jobs suck. Stop coming on here saying screw your job. All, guys, stop doing that because your average prospect, that's all they know. That's all they know. You have to educate to educate them. You have to give them value on how your business can help them walk away from their job if they want to. OK, but some people may not want to. Some people may have a career that they love. Some people may be a doctor, lawyer, school teacher. They love those careers. So if you're bashing their jobs, guys, they're not going to want to join you because they look at you as a negative person. So when you come live, Stay positive. Do not go into negativeville. Okay, don't do it. <laughs> Bernita says she's guilty. Bernita, guess what? All of us are guilty of it, right? That's why I'm doing this live Zach fact to clear this up, to clear it up. All right, so let's recap real quick. First of all, have a proper introduction when you do your Facebook lives. Second of all, give, give, give. Give more than you ask for, okay? Third thing is stay consistent. Stay consistent, okay? Fourth thing, guys, is stay positive. You got to stay positive. And the fifth thing I'm going to talk to you guys about is always give a call to action. All right? Always give your audience a call to action. Your, your, your audience has to know what you want them to do. But if you never tell them what you want them to do, they're not going to do anything. OK, so that's why every time I do a Facebook live, I tell you guys, please comment, please like and share. OK, I'm giving call to actions. OK, you guys have to give a call to action. Also, before you end your Facebook lives, tell your audience what to do next. Either tell them, go visit, you know, your YouTube channel, go visit your blog site, whatever it is, guys, you have to give your audience a call to action on what you want them to do next. So that way they can take the appropriate action. So that way you are able to generate a lead, okay? And after you generate that lead, you're going to find a need, and then you're going to close the sale. I hope you guys got that, <laughs> all right? Generate the lead, find the need, and then close the sale, 
All right. That's a whole other Zach fact for a whole other day. <laughs> All right. But yeah, guys, that is the proper way, four steps, I can call it, whatever you want to call it, the proper way to do a Facebook Live so that way you guys can maximize, you know, leveraging your time, generating leads, guys, and, you know, getting more sales and more team members. That's what you guys are looking to do. So I hope you guys got some value from this. If you did, like always, share it out. Leave me a comment below. Let me know you got some value. I appreciate all my live viewers for your comments. I appreciate all the thumbs up. So, guys, make sure you check back in the comment stream Probably in about like the next 10, 15 minutes, I'm going to drop a free training right there. <laughs> All right. I'm going to drop a free training in the comment stream about how to use Facebook Live. Okay, You guys want to make sure you check that out so you are using Facebook Live properly. You are generating leads, guys, and you are maximizing all your efforts on Facebook Live. So this is your boy, Zach Shaheed. My blog is mentorwithzach.net. You can go check that out as well for more free training. And uh, hey, I'm glad to be here, guys. Jason said, okay, all right, what's up, Jason? I'm going to look at my inbox as soon as I'm done, my man. I will do that. So hey, guys, hey, appreciate you guys. Anybody got any questions, as always, just like Jason, you can message me too. I'm always open for y'all guys to message me. I will answer all questions. So glad you guys got value. I appreciate it. And I will see you guys on the next live Zach Fat Peace.